Also happening today, jury selection is in its third day now in the murder trial for Chad Daybell. Daybell is facing the death penalty now for the deaths of his ex-wife Tammy Daybell and Lori Vallow's two children. Daybell married Vallow two weeks after his wife Tammy died back in October of 2019. ABC's Rena Roy is following this story. Rena, remind us of how, remind us of how we got here, what happened in court today. Well, Terry, you'll remember Chad Daybell is the so-called doomsday stepdad. He made national headlines back in 2020 when the bodies of his wife's children were found in shallow graves in his backyard. And he is charged in their murders, also with the murder of his first wife. As you mentioned, the criminal complaint says that Daybell endorsed religious beliefs that justified the homicides of the two children. Prosecutors say he and his wife, Lori Vallow, claimed her kids were zombies and then killed them. Now, if convicted of murder, Daybell is facing the death penalty, and his trial comes after Vallow's. She was sentenced to life in prison without parole, a jury unanimously finding her guilty for the deaths of her 16-year-old and 7-year-old. Both of them pleaded not guilty. Kira. So, Rena, how long is jury selection expected to last? Well, jury selection is expected to be about two weeks, and the trial as a whole about nine weeks. And look, legal experts say based on what we saw in Lori Vallow's trial, Daybell has a very large hill to climb. It's unclear if Vallow will testify at his trial. Neither of them testified in hers, and her lawyers actually rested their case without calling any witnesses. Daybell's case will be presided over by the same judge uh, in Vallow's trial, so it will be interesting uh, to see how this one plays out, guys. All right, Rena Roy, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.